All right, our Touchstone Energy Scholar of the Week is from Emory, and he has a real passion for the things he's, that he loves. Meet Quentin Bird. Quentin Berg has had a great experience at Bridgewater Emory High School. I would say this school is just unique compared to surrounding schools because they have so many different opportunities, whether it's FFA, FCCLA, the one act play, the sports activities, everything. He's the best type of student. Uh, he's the type of student who excels because he cares. He really has a passion for what he's doing and he wants to do well. He does many things well. The 3.96 student enjoys being in the band. However, there's one activity that really means a lot, 4-H. Uh, the main thing I was part of in this activity is livestock judging. This activity has given me so many different opportunities and has granted me some amazing things, whether it's meeting new people, going to new places, and just being a better person. Quentin made his college choice because of that. Down to Fort Scott Community College in Fort Scott, Kansas. I'll be going down there to judge for two years and uh, along my way to get a bachelor's degree in agricultural business. Since the eighth grade, he's also done the play-by-play -play for his high school's football and basketball teams on their YouTube channel. It's just one of those things that I just love and enjoy being part of and doing, and it, it's just been a huge part of my experience here at Bridgewater Emory High School. Honestly, as the voice of the Huskies athletics, the man does play-by-play -play better than anybody in business. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, for being named our Scholar of the Week, Quentin gets a $250 scholarship from the Central Electric Cooperative, which is a Touchstone Energy Cooperative. All right, stay with us. We'll be right back. The only news in primetime, Dakota News Now at 9. And good evening, everyone. I'm Brian Allen. I'm Andrea Anderson. 9 p.m. on Fox Sioux Falls. The Scholar of the Week is sponsored by your local Touchstone Energy Cooperatives.